Welcome to another Friday night. This is On Fire Family and this is Happy Hour. Cheers. Cheers. If you haven't joined us for one of these before, you're in for a treat. <laughs> At least by our standards. You're so lucky. We uh, sit here on Friday night, we pour ourselves a couple of drinks, and we pull up Yacht World, and we go shopping for our Great Loop boat. Our family of four is going on the Great Loop. That's our big family adventure, and we're departing in about 15 months. And we are looking for an adequately sized and equipped vessel to take us on this year-long and priced uh, journey. Uh, 6,000 miles, uh, 365 days together in a boat and we're excited and we're a little nervous because we need to be getting this boat. I want to get it sooner than later. So um, we're... You should be so lucky. We're working on it and uh, you guys are helping because you yes. watch these videos, you comment, you bring up great things that we have not even considered which is why we're doing this. Uh, we want to bring you guys along and uh, we really appreciate your feedback. So uh, like, subscribe, put a comment about a boat that we have missed in our search. Tonight is one of those. We, uh, <laughs> there's so many different carver models that uh, we have reviewed a 50 foot carver before, uh, but this is a smaller footprint mm -hmm. and has, I think, all the boxes that uh, we've mentioned. Checked. Must have. So, uh, Carver 466, this is a newer boat, 2001, that may be tied for the newest boat we've looked at uh, mm -hmm. for the loop. Uh, this is out of our price range at, right now at 209, but it's... Steals can be had. Good to dream, and it uh, gives us an idea of what's out there, and in the next year, maybe um, prices come down. There's, um, as one of the commenters said, deals can be had, mm -hmm. so we'll, we'll see about that. Uh, so here we are, this uh, 2001 Carver 466 Edgewater Maryland. Uh, let's get into it and see what we got. It's uh, definitely a newer looking boat. I ranked this up there with like the Silverton we looked at. Mm. Um, more kind of just molded fiberglass. Yeah. You know? I'm pretty much happy on anything, anywhere. I mean, I like to eat at all sorts of different restaurants and stay at all sorts of different places and recreate on all sorts of different boats. And so he's the one that has to be convinced about a newer boat. But I also like the older boats, so he doesn't have to do much convincing with me. So I just took a personality test this week uh, <laughs> where they rate you on um, openness. So what mm -hmm. you're just describing is your high openness. I'm yeah. low openness. I like antique and classic boats. If it's not made out of wood, uh, it's a compromise. If it's gonna be made out of fiberglass, it better be old fiberglass. Uh, but 2001, let's just, <laughs> high openness, low openness. Yeah. Maximum adventure though, so here we go. Uh, yeah. yeah. It looks yeah. nice. It does. That looks nice. It does, everything's white, everything's plastic, everything's shiny. But it's, Bright and airy. It's open, yeah. Yes. Uh, small kind of, I don't know if they call it cockpit, elevated cockpit or sun deck here, but uh, you know, four of us could sit here. Yeah, and you can zipper, guess... zipper all that open and it's nice. And check out that wet bar. Very lovely. Cheers, wet bar. I like it. It has a cool bell you can ding. Yeah. Uh, this is the hatch. Uh, Those are kind of cool, Space down H. into the salon area there. Yeah, it's it's canvas in the back where you can unzip and mm -hmm. um, and I like these wing doors, full yeah. glass or plastic the wing doors wing where doors. you can walk right out into the uh, walk around, uh, steps up into the flybridge that's where nice. it's not a ladder. So that's nice. And I think a lot of people are looking for that too. So when you talk about reselling a boat, this is a boats, very nice. It is. Flybridge. Bigger than some of the ones we've seen where it's integrated and there's just a small bench for the pilot right. or, uh, yeah, to have a, a, like a dining area up here is very nice. Yeah. Three captain's chairs. Very mm -hmm. nice. Because our daughter also has a boating license. And so the three of us will be all driving the boat. So 
Yeah, I could see us. It would be nice for him training her and I at the same time. It still reminds me of Starship Enterprise, where everybody's like sitting and then you're like engaged. Star Trek is my absolute favorite. I'm a big dork. Surprisingly, I'm the nerd of the family. Mm So, I mean, unless we're talking about books. Surprisingly. What? (laughs) Yeah, I mean, it looks like a combo race car spaceship for the helm. It's got some modern good stuff. Lots of switches and knobs and things. Uh, it's definitely one of those more modern books. This kind of looks like a car door panel to me. It's got like a speaker. It's got a cup holder. You expect to like roll down the window. You know, and... convenience is not bad. It's true. The world needs cup holders. And I bet the maintenance on this is way lower than on a 1981. We'll see. Motor, yeah. It's a debate we're going to have. <laughs> Maybe we're going to have it later tonight. We'll see. Uh, it looks like we've probably got accommodations here for a dinghy to be able to flip up. That's probably what this but there's, deal is, is right there. there. Uh, not on this picture, but I don't know if it comes with one or it doesn't. We uh, need it to come with one. Uh, yeah, at this price for sure. It, uh, steps down in, rather than a ladder too, yeah, down to the swim Yeah, a nice step. big swim deck. Uh, and then it uh, looks like probably a hand shower down here too. And, Lovely. You know, lots of those nice to haves. That's a nice big salon. Looks like lots of seating down lots here. Lots of so seating. Like, I prefer this dinette to like one of those bench bench. Oh, I like the bench bench because it's cozy, but this is lovely too. Yeah. I mean, and it can... does, oh, remember, I can't remember what boat it was where it was like the dinette was practically on top of the couch. Yeah. Um, but this is nice and spread out. There's just tons of seating here. So there's the dinette, there's this couch, there's this couch. They're and across from each other. And, the and then stools. bar. Yeah. The stools. That's, that's... Bar stools right at the breakfast bar or whatever. Lots of places that. to homeschool and eat and... And buy. <laughs> Home is where the anchor Watch drops. a giant TV. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, and uh, nice woodwork, you know, for a uh, boat. It is. Yeah, it's vintage, not blonde. Right? It's... And that's all that we can hope for, I think. And, there, and it's ample. Like, there's not, uh, it's not all vinyl. And look at this. I like think it... they learned from their mistakes of the 90s. I don't know. I've, I've but yeah, it. I like the tile. I like the countertop. Yeah. Yeah. Is this tile on the front of a maybe dishwasher or Might trash be, compactor? Like, sticky. Yeah, we've done. Uh, we're not ashamed. We've done that. Uh, <laughs> this must be the opposite stateroom. This looks like tons of storage just every which way. Oh, there's a bar oh. in the aft stateroom. Comes with champagne. <laughs> I'm gonna just get a little nightcap. Uh, yeah, so this must be the aft head I, with a built-in, that's a nice like, fully enclosed shower, shower, like that. Or maybe it was the front. I don't know. Here's the uh, V-berth in the front, and then tons of storage along either side, up top, and yeah. drawers underneath. Nice one to this one. And the third oh, stage room. Oh, that. That's so cute. So yeah. So I don't know if you got to crash town to get all in here, but I think he's a boy. He'll have fun with that. He'll love this. This is probably the second. Good. Yeah, second head. Mm-hmm. I don't That's know. Nice Looks too. an awful lot like the first one. And then the washer. Probably wow. combo washer dryer. Combo washer dryer. There was an iron inside. Yeah. Don't turn it on with that on. <laughs> but that, hey, Safety that's tip. that's an important um, note of interesting storage options. Yeah. Stuff, stuff in the washer dryer. Engine room, generator. Uh, these are Volvo uh, diesels. Uh, and you access them through the salon floor, like you lift up a hatch. Mm-hmm. We have a hatch now. So it's not like a walk-in with full, but it doesn't look too tiny. Right. And they look pretty clean, right? Not sure. I don't know how quiet that is being right there under the salon, but... <laughs> um, Probably not with the generator, but... I don't know, it's got a sound box around it, so hmm. maybe not. Well, there you go. I think it's nice. It has lots of great amenities. Yeah. It, and it, I think it will be easier to sell after the loop. And this is a thing that we're more and more concerned with mm-hmm. because uh, we're from Portland, Oregon. We're on the West Coast. We want to do the loop. The loop, unfortunately, doesn't circle by our little <laughs> neck of the woods. So it's on the East Coast. And so we need to buy a boat after the kids are done with school for the year in the summertime do the loop, and then sell it the following summer. And so if we get a vintage boat 
that would be that we my love. preference, then uh, we might be the only people that love that book. <laughs> so uh, that would make it harder to and sell. And we have to remember, it's not our forever book. It's our one year book. And it's a tool, right? It's a tool for doing this massive adventure of the Great Loop. And so... Uh, where... We'll be off of the boat a lot, having fun. Yeah, and whereas uh, if it's my boat here, I can go and tinker it on the tinker with it on the weekends mm -hmm. uh, all the time and really enjoy that. But if I'm tinkering with it daily on the loop, I may hate life a little bit more. Mm -hmm. So, uh, we'll see. But... Yeah, I, I'm not completely turned off by this boat. <laughs> Two thumbs up then. <laughs> <laughs> One and a half thumbs, decidedly up. Uh, thank you guys for joining us for another uh, happy hour. Uh, we really do appreciate your comments and um, if you've subscribed, we really do appreciate that. It helps us out. Uh, if you have another boat that we've not looked at that you think as we foray into these a little bit more expensive, a little more modern boats, especially that's not what we've been looking at lately. Mm -hmm. So if you know of one, we really appreciate you um, putting a comment down below yeah, and we'll uh, take a look at it. Awesome. All right. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers.